Cuffed versus uncuffed tracheostomy explained. We use a cuffed tracheostomy if a patient has a trach and is mechanically ventilated. We use an uncuffed tracheostomy for patients who are not ventilated. Well, why? A cuffed trach has a balloon that seals the airway to help ventilator air reach the lungs. While it may reduce aspiration risk, it does not fully prevent aspiration. All of the air pushed through the trach will go into the lungs and not escape through the mouth, where an uncuffed trach has no balloon, so air can pass around it, allowing the patient to breathe normally and speak. The cuff pressure is typically maintained at 20 to 30 centimeters of water and is measured using a manometer. Since there is a pressurized balloon protecting the airway, patients with cuff trachs cannot speak, while patients with deflated or uncuffed trachs are able to speak. And finally, risk of injury exists in both, but cuffed appliances have a higher risk of injury. Cuffed tracheostomies have pressure which is applied to the airway, so this high or too much pressure can cause injury. Where uncuffed trachs have a lower risk of injury to the mucosa of the airway since the pressure does not exist. That's all for cuff trach versus an uncuff trach. Happy studying future nurses.